Hey, what's going on guys? It's Pat and welcome back to Minecraft Epic Proportions. And today we have a ton of stuff to do. I mean, there's so many mods installed, I don't even know what to do first. But I did put some rotten flesh in here so we can make some leather. Someone did suggest that I make a backpack that can craft. I didn't even know you could do this, guys, but it's probably going to be really useful. So crafting table and leather around it. Bam, I've got myself a workbench backpack. So now basically all I need to do is just, you know, right click, bam, crafting table. That should save me a lot of time because normally, you know, I place it down. I like carry it with me everywhere. It's like my best friend. And well, my girlfriend was until she died. I, that was sad she died last time. But um, yeah, you put it down. Then I have to switch back with battle gear to here to my axe and then break it, pick it back up. This should probably save me a lot of time and be really useful. Um, but other than that, a couple more things I really wanted to make. I actually got some sand. I think there was like coal in here. Yeah, I got some sand. I know people suggested grabbing it right from my castle. I just couldn't do that. This is a masterpiece right here. I had to go down to the beach to get this sand. I wouldn't wreck this. It's kind of weird how there's sand here actually, now that I think about it. But um, <laughs> anyways, I really need this. What I want to make is diamond furnaces and I also want to make a telepad. If we could set one up here and then one in the fanchion, it would like save so much time and be really nice because it's kind of far away. I feel like I'm flying so far just to get there. And today I want to set up the minions too so they can go mining for me. Probably be really useful. Alright, so I've got six glass. I need like a bunch of stuff out of here, I think. I need uh, diamonds, redstone, ender pearls. Let's see. I think I need to actually take this and make myself an iron block. And if I use this, let me check out the recipe. So I want to make a telepad. Glass on top, redstone sides. Okay, block on... Okay, I got this. I got this, guys. We have enough for that. All right, so let me see here. Try to do it now. Memory, don't fail me. All right, so I think it was like that with redstone on the sides, and bam, there we go. Two telepads. So this should save us a lot of time and be really useful. Like, if there's a cool area that's far away, like an awesome, like, pirate ship or something, all I need to do is put down a telepad there and one in my house, and I'm good. And I think we'll only need one ever in the house, which is kind of cool. I could put it in, like, the throne room, but it would look really weird. Plus, it's not even. It would have to be bigger, I think. So, these sections on the side, we have to do something with them. I'm thinking telepads. You know, it, there's nothing here. What else do I put here? I have no idea. So, I'm going to put one down. Let me move this. Put it on the wall. Light it up. And telepad on the floor. Name your telepad. Right now, we are over the ocean. So, that's the default name. But, um, epic castle. Nice spelling so far. Castle home. Exclamation. Yeah, that's it. Bam. And now I just need to set up one somewhere else. And we've got this right here. The register. This needs to be on us or it won't recognize where the other telepads are. So I better not lose this. Really got to hold on to it. Probably can't put it in a backpack either. Probably not. Um, but look at this thing. That's kind of scary, isn't it? It's like another dimension. So, I want to make some diamond furnaces, and then we're off to get the minions going, and then we'll try some type of, like, dungeon or tower. I saw one around, anyway. Alright, so everything is done. So, I will grab all these and make diamond furnaces. It's going to be so quick. It's going to be amazing. Alright, so let me see here. So, if I put them right here, recipe. That was... I didn't mean recipe. Use. Okay, so diamonds there and glass in the corners. I think we got everything. One, two, three. One, two, three. Really upping the furnace power right now. What else do I need? Diamonds. All right. I'm wasting all my diamonds on this. It's not really a waste, though. I mean, what else am I going to use them for? My gear's actually getting really good. So, need to use it for something. Okay. Diamond furnaces. They make me look so much more epic. They're diamond. It's beautiful. I think we can actually upgrade them one more time, but I don't have the materials for it. It's like magma cream and... And diamond blocks or something ridiculous. Alright, I want to smelt something to test this out. Do I have anything on me? Maybe in my backpack? Let's see. Anything in here I can smelt? The titanium ore. I can smelt that. Let's see. Alright, smelt it quickly. Now that is a quick furnace right there. That's pretty ridiculous, actually. That's going to be useful. But um, the minions need to get me more ore so I can actually make something out of this stuff. Alright, let me put down some stuff and we will leave. I don't really need any of this on me. Don't want to waste any inventory space. And the last telepad, I'll hold on to it because at the end we're going to go to the fanchion and I'll just put it down there. So I think it's time to go. Time to leave the castle. 
I love this place. This place is awesome. I just need to replace this with some cooler blocks, and it will look so cool. But yeah, the minions, where should we put them? I'm trying to think, like, they got a mine somewhere. Maybe, like, right next to the castle would be useful. Find a place to jump off over here. Maybe over here. Because they jump up. Don't kill me. Is that a butterfly? I think so. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to put it down, like, um, right up on this small hill. And they're going to dig for me. It should be really useful. But first, we must commit to evil. I actually needed experience for this. So, um, and I switched it from M to N, guys. If you're familiar with minions, it's normally M. I had to because, you know, the map was M. So if you download the mod pack, you need an N for it. The darkness listens. Commit to evil. All right. Mock peace Nobel. They're really weird, by the way. Mock peace Nobel Prize. Destroy cardboard boxes. Supreme hedonism. I think, you know, since it's the evilest of all, I'm going to destroy some cardboard boxes. There's like some kind of sound effect coming. All right. So the language was much worse. And that one that I expected, so I may edit that out just for the younger audience that watches my videos. The gods are pleased with your sacrifice. And that's my favorite part. The gods are pleased with my sacrifice. Alright, we need to do this like four times. Commit to evil. Baby seal clubbing. Insurance fraud. Support Fox News. I wouldn't club a baby seal. I'm gonna support Fox News. Go with that. So I'm trying to stay quiet during the, the sound effects. Alright, so yeah, there's always some kind of sound effect going on. Um, that one was, you know, not as not as bad as the other one. Alright, make dinner. Alright, I'll make dinner. Let's go with that. <laughs> Think I may have just murdered a chicken. The gods are pleased with your sacrifice. Alright, and one more. Jam radio frequencies. We'll, we'll go with that, why not? We'll go with that. I don't know what that's sound like. <laughs> are so weird. The gods have rewarded your offering. All right, they rewarded me with a master staff. I'm starting to get night. All right, so let's get this going. If I right click my minion, he will listen to what I want him to do. He can mine, chop trees, all kinds of cool stuff. I think we can get four. Yeah, and it makes you really hungry to summon these guys in. All right, so this is how it works. So if I hit N again, it says unsummon them, dig mine trap, strip mine. They can do two, which is cool. I hit dig here. I can customize this. Let's make it like five by five. Make it so. And I need to put this in my hand. You actually have to face down when you do it um, for it to actually work correctly. Dig mine shaft. And they'll dig it wherever I want them to. Right click. Go for it, guys. This is so awesome. And if you want them to work quicker, smack them with the staff. Come on, guys. Work quicker. Look how good they're doing now. Faster. Faster. Come on. You guys are taking forever. I need this mine dug right away. Right away. I know. I'm starting to feel a little bad. And I think if I... Is it if I right click with this? I don't know. I know I can shoot lightning with it too. Okay, there we go. Like that. It's kind of cool. It doesn't hurt mobs though. Faster. Come on, guys. They even build stairs for you. It's like nighttime. I'm going to go to sleep and then we'll go to um where I want it to go. All right, because it's nighttime, they'll just keep digging, I think, during my sleep, I'd imagine. But yeah, I'm going to head to bed, and we will head into a tower that I saw. All right, perfect landing. There we go. You want to just wait for me? Just wait for me. I'll be back in a minute. Going to sleep. All right, here we go. And it shows that there's no mobs in here, which is nice, because, you know, I put up the lights and stuff. It's kind of dark in here. Probably should add some more. But we'll go to sleep now, and hopefully they're still digging. All right, a brand new day. Awesome. So the dragon waited for me. Thank you so much for waiting. All right, we'll head out this way. If you can fit. And let's see how they're doing. All right, I got to be patient. Normally, in this mod, like originally, you'd hit left shift to go down. Now it dismounts you. So I'm really, like, paranoid about it that I'm accidentally going to hit it and just kill myself. All right, let's see. How you guys doing? Wow, you guys are quick. That is a quickly built mine. But I think you need a little more motivation. Need some more motivation? Let's go. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. What are you doing? Work better. Um, If I right-click them, they'll actually give me their stuff. Give me the stuff. There we go. That is so cool. So, yeah, you can actually take their stuff and it'll stop them. So, now I've got, like, all kinds of stuff. 
And I think I should be able to get the mining once again the same way. Dig mine shaft. Let me try to get it in the same spot here. You're like standing on it. You're standing on the thing. All right, let me try it from a different direction here. All right, how about right there? There we go. Good enough. So, yeah, they're going to build it one over. I could fix that pretty easily anyway. But, um, yeah, he was standing in the spot. Kind of annoying. So, now the stairs are, like, going to continue right there. You can actually make something pretty intricate. But, basically, for me, what I want to do is just get ore. I don't really care how it looks. They're going to dig down to bedrock, and then we'll make a strip mine. So, yeah, it's going to be one off. It's kind of funny. <laughs> looks kind of cool, though. I like it anyway. I'm just going to have to add some stairs to that part right there myself. All right, so they are working, and we are going to head over to this tower I saw. Kind of cool, though. I like minions. It works like Simucraft. I know they can build a mine, too. And the minions, they're funnier, so, so they win, I guess. I don't know. I thought it was a cool thing for this type of series. I added it to the mod pack on purpose because, um, basically, the way I was thinking of it, as an adventure pack, sometimes you want to do dungeons and fight bosses, and you don't feel like mining that much. So I thought it'd be good. A scary hole. You go first, sheep. Go first. See what happens. Okay. I'm. Oh, a chest. Oh, you're fine. So yeah, might need to relog. Oh, he's, he made it. He made it. He's okay. <laughs> I'm just gonna ignore this actually. Just pretend there's not a problem here. I'm sure if I relog, it'd be fine. But um, whatever. For now. All right. Yeah. That that's that's not strange and scary or anything. All right, I'm ready for this tower. Rare one to start. Let's go. Lightning. Die. I'm poisoned. All right, he's dead. Okay, so let me switch here to my cool weapons. And get... I'm running so quick. I shouldn't have done this. I shouldn't have done it. There's so many spawners. Skeleton over there. Get the creeper one. Get the creeper one. Come on. Get him, Iron Golem. Iron Golem's helping me out, of course. Die. Die. I'll kill you with whatever I must. All right, I got his bow. This poison's really hurting me. Anyone else notice the poison is about to kill me? All right, I'm going to go with a potion right now just to be safe here. Let me get some food so I can regen my health. All right, we're good. So, yeah, this should be pretty challenging no matter what. Top floor? No. Okay. <laughs> just checking. It should be pretty hard. All right, so we are heading down. Oh, ran right past you guys. Sorry about that. You dead? About to die now. I am like crazy. I see those spiders. I see them. I don't need the girlfriend. I know she died, guys, and it was sad. We'll get a new one soon, but I figured this tower I could do myself. I feel like I've got the power. All right, is there any more? There's kind of a lot around here. Iron Golem's trying to protect me. There's a ridiculous amount of spawners in this place. I just heard a really scary noise. Pretend it's not happening. Oh, God. Okay, so that is definitely not what I want to do at all, but we're fine. I'm still getting used to my controls. Nice. All right. The battle has begun here. I'm just going to take these out. Go back to the first floor so mobs don't spawn there. I hear a creeper. But I think we're okay. Yeah, I'm just going to end out at the bottom, aren't I? They're just knocking me down there. Why do you guys got to be so dangerous? Little dudes everywhere. All right, we're fine. Everything's okay, guys. There's just a lot of mobs around. Okay. Okay, I'm not nervous. My heart isn't beating extremely quick or anything like that. All right, let's go back where we're supposed to be and finish this up the way we should. Because the mobs are going to spawn and come through the ceiling at me if I don't. All right, so this one was good, but we... Did we fall from here? We fell from kind of high. Oh, there's spiders coming from here. Can't be good. All right, let me get this. I know I hear it. I just need to break it. Break it quick. They're trying to knock me into the hole. <laughs> okay, I'm going to kill him first. All right, cave spiders, just die. Everything is okay now. Let's calm down, take a breather, get rid of this. Put down a torch in the middle. I keep hearing some kind of weird noise. And let me get some food. All right, we're good. We're good here. And if you're curious about my health bar, this is actually my second health bar. So I've got five hearts on the second one and ten on the first. So I've got 15 hearts in total. So it works a little bit different than last season, but it's kind of cool and takes up less room, which is probably good. All right, rewards. Coal. I'll take coal and string, whatever. You can have the dirt. And what is these? what are these noises I keep hearing? I don't want sugar. Not right now. All right, you guys. 
you gotta stop following me. All right, in here. Okay, that's where I just came from. They're making me paranoid. Anything around? All right, I'm gonna put up some torches around here. Because it's really dark. And if monsters are spawning, it's gonna make this challenging. Oh, yeah, I need to be in this inventory to actually open a chest. Flint and steel. Let's see. Anything I need? A little string. And eh, we'll get some stuff for bread. I don't really need it too much, though. The thing is, um, at the house, we have, like, a giant farm. It's huge. All right, another torch there. Oh, you guys look scary. All right, get him, Iron Golem. He only has every effect known to man. He has 120 health. Okay, and he teleported away. Whether that's good or bad. Oh, sorry. Hey, guys. What's going on? <laughs> so, um, they apparently ran out of inventory space. And they're like, we're going to give this to him right now. So, I'm going to kill these things. I wish they knew how to fight. They don't know how to fight. Die. Die. Almost got it. This one's really tough. Oh, he teleported right before it. I know. I'm, I'm going to get it. You guys got to relax. What's wrong with this zombie? Die. I got it. All right. So, they... <laughs> I don't need this much cobblestone right now. Go back to mining. That's ridiculous. And they're trying to give me... Oh, I see diamonds. You guys did a good job. You guys did a good job. Give me those. Good job. All right. So, yeah, this is actually kind of hard. He keeps teleporting. I know. I know. Relax. Lots of spiders over here. All right. So, I'm going to kill these. I hate spiders. They all must die. So many of them. All right. I think things have calmed down a little. I'm going to put all this in here. One diamond. Let's see how it is. You guys got more stuff for me? This is crazy. They have ridiculous amounts of this. So if we really need cobblestone at some point, I think we'll be good. I'd imagine. I got the diamond. You guys have anything else for me? All right, they're good. So they gave me everything. They actually go up to you and hand it to you. So I need to tell them to mine again. So we'll do that at another point. I'll probably do it off camera and just get the mining. All right. We must finish this. All right, switching back. And here we go. Oh, God. 320 a fishing zombie. With 320. 320 fishing zombie. That's ridiculous. That kind of health on a zombie that just likes to go fishing. Oh, that was really bad. That was really bad. Switching to cooler weapon really quick. This is really awful. Die. Everything die. Run. Run. This is how it's done, guys. You use your amazing speed to get out of this. <laughs> this weapon will save my life, I hope. Jump over everything. Quicker. All right. Now that is how it's done, guys. That was a pro escape right there. Wow. Now that sword is useful. All right, we're good. We're, go we're going back down. Going back down one step at a time. I don't know how I survived that. All right. So there's a lot of mobs around. They're coming from everywhere. I can't believe we lived through that. Let me try something. This might actually um, be more useful at the moment. All right. So let me just toss this here for a second. Switch back. Eat some food. And put these down. I don't want to fall through the floor. Not at all. Got some kind of weird boots on over there. So I'm break these. I got that one. Get him. Kill him. I don't care what I'm using. Okay, this floor is now safe. Put up a torch. Awesome. Okay, so this floor is good. And gotta switch back to actually use the chest. Iron ingots, not too bad. The flint in here. Some more wheat and some more bread. Awesome. I hear like a thousand mobs, by the way. All right. Die fishing zombie. I mean, fire zombie. All kinds of zombies coming. So many. Kill the minions. I wish you could. All right, so there's a lot of mobs coming. Oh, he grabbed me with his fishing rod or something. All right, so guys, this is, this is a little hard. This is a torturous place. Okay, lighten it up. Lighten it up. Oh my god, this place is crazy. I'm tr Come on, come on. You you got you have to be like this. This is going to be a longer episode than usual. I did not expect this to take as long as it is. 
All right, fire zombie. You must die. Your friends are all crazy. Well, I gotta say, I really know how to make a series difficult. I'm very good at that, apparently. <laughs> Trying to switch back to this. Oh, do you take my weapon? Give it back. Give it back. All right. Die, skeleton. And break the spawner right now. All right, cool. That one's broken. And... Torch. Okay, so the annoying thing is I actually need to switch, like, this back into here. All right, there we go. He's, like, right in my face. Die. So many spiders. There's millions. I'm on fire. All right, everything's dying. Did we ever check this? Yeah, we did. Anything I can put down? Leather boots. Yeah. I can put those down. Glowstone dust. Um, couple fire charges. Things I don't need too much of. I'm trying not to be crazy about my inventory like I am sometimes. Where I have like a million things. Alright. We're good here. Let me just have some food. Oh, come on, spiders. I'm about to fall down again. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Switching back to something here. Okay. There they are. Stuck to the ceiling. I think we're almost down to the bottom, guys. <laughs> but this has been crazy. It really has been. I didn't expect this to be so challenging. <laughs> Where did he go? You will die. Diamond sword. Let me just grab that. Thank you. Got a skeleton head, too. Okay. So you guys, you gotta stop bothering me. I've got 40 levels of experience, at least. Oh, we made it to the bottom floor. We made it. I'm thinking the rewards at the bottom have to be the best, right? We made it. That was extremely hard. Extremely. Okay, so what's in here? Let me switch, and... What a reward. Beautiful iron ingots and wheat. That's crazy, isn't it? That's what they give me. That's all I get. I see how it is. But anyways, guys, we totally crushed this place after some horribleness. But, um, we're going to go to the fansion now and put the people in. So, guys, we are almost to the fansion. And what I'm going to do is put down this telepad somewhere around here. Let me see. Is this the room? Try to figure it out. All right, let me get off. I think this is the room for um, the fansion. I know it had a emerald golem in it. But, yeah, today's winners were right here. Haley Moist, Chazmaster777, Carol Thomas, Iron Golem's like standing in the way, Cody Gross, Peter Phillips, and Ian Smart, so congrats to all of you. And yeah, more likes equals more people in the fanchin. But I need to put this down before we end this. Let me see here. Alright, so I got my telepad. And where should I put it? There's gotta be a place for it. Maybe. Hmm. This is a tough tr I'm not good at this. These are tough decisions. I could honestly just put it, like, in the middle, like, of something here so it's easy to access everything. I don't want to put it in a specific room. Or do I? This one's, like, broken. I'm just going to put it here for now. I can always switch it anyway. And there we go. Fanchin, we'll call it. Obviously, you know. Fanchin. So now we can actually use this to teleport back and forth. Let's try. This is so cool. And it should pop up. Epic Castle Home. And here we are. Very cool. So that's going to be really useful. Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and to subscribe. Thanks for watching. I will see you next time.